so welcome back a quick session again this weekly live today today we'll have something interesting i hope you will like there are some good updates and insights from the student who is from brazil who is studying a phd in tsukuba university like recently we have shared the interesting inspiring story similarly she has some interesting up, uh, feedback for the aspirants uh, she couldn't get into live so she gave the uh, information i am going to discuss with you and uh, some more observations before that uh, the current hot topic is application for next embassy review right many people are preparing i think uh, addressing the application document once again in a quick way maybe another it's a good for many of you so i'm hoping to do that as well today so we, uh, already you have prepared the application documents i have been sharing in the facebook group or nimble prayer in a facebook group so you can uh, prepare the document keep revising give some two three days gap and then keep revising and then go for submission before couple of days don't submit uh, immediately uh, last day is not recommended but it's good and recommended to submit before so submit it few days before but keep revising that's a secret people follow people may not tell you but i am telling you here you revisit yourself that will be good after few days again so that is one thing and second thing uh, zoom is live i think you can log in whoever is wanted i am talking it is audible for both zoom and this one i'll be listening to you in the zoom uh, in some time let me complete this one quickly so this is one side uh, uh, let me open this application on the screen where is my this one i should keep it on the right side i think this mic again another one i actually was in some other work but i thought of not to break this uh, interaction with you all uh, so to put some information so i came here uh, so this mic is also good i believe so let me show the application here the next uh, undergrad people please don't uh, get too much anxious or too much worried it will come soon undergrad applications will come soon you cannot do anything after coming you have to rush for the submission so try to prepare the documents then only you will know what is the mistakes or what you wanted to know so it's recommended that you keep keep modifying the documents and keep preparing don't wait for the deadlines or notification like next embassy people are saying it uh, for the pg it is saying very short of time uh, for india it is 15 plus 4 19 days uh, it is about three weeks or two to three weeks so for UG also it will be similar so don't worry about that one don't wait just to prepare yourself and be ready that is one side and let me go for the documents for the pg uh this one this is a form you are supposed to send so just don't focus anything else because you will have some more time to look back about uh other requirements or other procedures so just focus on this document getting it more effective and more uh, good for this time so i would highly recommend you focus this one alone for this few days so let me quickly comment back for you another thing though you are hurry for suggestions and get some inputs and uh, submit the things i don't see people are able to do it uh, even though they got suggestions so it's unless you understand and you write it's very high very high in the competition right so that is one and application guidelines yes so this is the topic i'm talking where is this one i have explained already very clearly i'm not going again the same so this one application uh, opens at uh, diplomatic mission first screening yeah this first screening now you submit this document then submission of placement reference form and second screening this will have time for submission of document these documents they will inform they will update in the website so don't worry now just focus on the application form for this for this the first uh, what do you call for now and these three i think first three let me go through that one where is a uh, screen so this my document let's see prelim yes this is a document right so i'm talking about this document 
for one more time field of study don't use your own field of studies or different even though you are, i have been talking in all the videos please check other videos and the live videos recent lives you will understand what is the field of study you need to choose only the fields of study that they have mentioned you cannot you invent your own field of fields of study because this is selection and they have to filter out so this is a field of study they have given you have to choose these things only in this one you may have sub fields that fields you can choose after the first selection for the first selection somebody is asking biology chemistry and all i don't find here i'm sorry that my friend who is that anyway so i am recommending is my eyes clear or uh, always clear let me see my mobile outcome yeah this one here so uh, this fields just put as it is for now i would for me i am from mechanical i would choose to put maybe materials engineering or else i will choose to put uh, something related to my field uh, mathematical science also sometimes people do from mechanical background or maybe uh, mechanical engineering itself so you choose only one not many so only one you choose then you write it here not everything this is i just put for your understanding so you cannot put everything so i'll put only let's say i put only this one so this one i don't know just put this one and then courses applied fields of study is this one and courses applied uh this is actually the courses here it's only research student right so type is research student the course uh, master course or phd course graduate school level so i would recommend to fill this one uh, in this format uh, i will recommend research students uh, and i'll recommend to put this one i'll recommend to put like this for me i'm phd uh, as a guy so i'll put research uh, research phd course i'll put like this so i'll recommend to put something like this for masters you put research masters course like that and then this is a name and this is the date of birth so just put something and the age you calculate with the age calculator and put exactly it will be good 26 or 25 or 29 24 whatever whatever you can put so 27 i put for now five months like that contact number you put your own country and then you put these numbers properly is it 10 4 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and email id abc at nimble perena if i write nimble perena at gmail.com so you can put even my mobile number whatsapp number you all having this in the group i can i can put i mean you put your number here i would recommend uh, for pg people right this is not for pg so for pg people you already know 10th you will have and intermediate you will have and year of processing you will say uh, year of processing 2010 2012 2016 2018 something like this so you can put these things so these you just put uh, from your certificates and this one try not to remove these headings i don't i find a couple of places don't they are recommending not to remove these things so don't remove just try to fill these documents even though you are not ready with all your documents try to fill these documents from now from a day even yesterday or whatever today so that whatever the pending columns you keep revising every time whenever you get time to sit with the application don't try to think of finishing in one sitting or two sittings it is not recommended from my side at least so uh, uh, for better quality i am referring so this one whatever you have please mention if you have qualified or not if you are not qualified not applicable you can write i'll recommend i'm not finding this any clue but i am saying this is my recommendation applicable and gre not applicable so these two can put in a bold for them this is one so this uh, another one is list of awards or certificates or medals if any give the details so here you put only state level or national level like in any exams or competitive exams you may have written or any sports activities or anything you put these things uh, sports or competitive competitions 
or any coding uh, etc you can put there is no limit at this stage but there is a limit in the later stage so better you can put anything on state level you can put any competitions or the same thing competitions or sports or games or even uh, tech events anything you can put international level awards maybe i don't know what uh, some people may have some awards so we can put this one also and then uh, yeah this one some people are asking about the publication details please uh, uh, excuse me yesterday and day people study there are many doubts i couldn't answer them but most of the other doubts i have answered below the video and even below the uh, uh, in the whatsapp group also but mostly below the video will be helpful if you comment i will answer it will be there for others also so try to comment in below i can answer uh, 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 mostly i will answer and also uh, whatsapp group is also fine but whatsapp group i think the old messages cannot be seen to the newcomers so better you can comment in the in the video below it will be good or even the google facebook group i am trying to keep some valuable content that is i, I didn't put any restrictions but uh, i'm moderating to keep the content useful even whatsapp groups i'm moderating just to keep the content valuable for others most of us there is lot of content you may or may not know there is a lot of content even in other context people are having this spam even in japan i'm seeing many spam groups and spam updates this is making difficult to find which is reliable which is not reliable so i am here to tell you in this group so i am trying to keep it moderated even uh it is not allowed like i'm uh, if there is something misleading i'm saying no it is not recommended but if you still go ahead it's up to you but those who are speaking a lot in the groups i heard a bit a bit odd feedback they are not uh, seriously making things but some people are doing that is good uh, so uh, it's a general observation so better don't sp spam the groups uh, and don't get into spam groups get into our, our discussions you'll be uh, in a better state i could say yeah this publication uh, the publication details uh, actually this one those people who don't have please ignore if you have it you will have details there was another student recently asking in comments or whatsapp group i'm not sure so the person is asking about how to write i said you can ignore if you don't have then uh, the person is asking uh, in that case what is the format and all basically if you have the paper or rebook or journal they will have basic uh, information so you know what to fill if you don't have please ignore it it is okay it is all right for masters people bachelors uh, people say you will not have papers but my juniors have the papers in the bachelors b1 b2 b3 b4 b, uh, in this years itself even b2 itself so it's not true for all so if you have you write some publication details journal name author name doi everything will be there with the publication if you don't have don't get wrong or don't think that they are super qualified you are not qualified it's not like that don't think so this is one thing and the master's thesis details uh if you if you are a bachelor's a master's applicant you put your bachelor's thesis details you can put masters or you may put bachelor's it need not to be the final one whatever the current state they also know that the final submission may vary so you can put whatever at this date uh, when you are writing this application whatever your thesis content looks like let's say my initial thesis in my uh, bachelor's time i was working with the sterling engine uh sterling engine for solar applications i was thinking that one for many of the months i was working later i changed it completely to another field that is a uh, uh, shock observers uh, designing uh, design and manufacturing if you see my uh, personal page it is also there in the google sites it's public page from my linkedin page so actually uh, let me show you i think yeah anyway that title is also it's different so you can use the current title they will verify with that details how much you are working what you are capable of they will evaluate based on that one there is nothing wrong or nothing nothing right for the this situation for the date you write whatever the thesis title you feel it may be the final or not final if you have supervisor who is connected with you try to discuss with him or with her and then write this title and the areas of research this also based on the uh, title it will be in falling in one of the area you can put in that area one second this is, uh, i think this african group i tried to help but a nigerian friend yesterday i was busy 
I think I could get them today. But if this message I put silent. So someone guide for this are you, please get into live man i can discuss now after this one anyway i'll discuss about this let me complete yeah here is a research and supervisor name you can put abstract you can put abstract you try to put shorter one it will be good uh, maybe 150 or 200 words or maybe uh, this is right it can be a bit more 500 words but not so big and name of the publication out of the thesis maybe you can put proposed or under uh, construction something sir bachelor thesis won't comes under present and past work i think master's thesis form is filled for doctorate uh yes a field asked uh, age for first shouldn't be for april that is true you were asking son in the comment box uh, but uh, mm, present past work this is actually i'm talking the title before that applicant that uh, field of study document i think here they can fill i i to my understanding and then yeah this one you are talking maybe here we cannot fill maybe the experience part but uh, there are columns you can fill let me see so the name and the nationality and the field of study so don't edit these columns uh, because there is this details about within two pages that is four sheets and also this uh, japanese and english translation is there don't edit and the plagiarism discord plagiarism somebody is asking actually uh, uh, we cannot verify but if you write by yourself uh, it is mostly be fine plagiarism softwares are there i think i have license from iit but uh, i'll check if it is active or the uh, I'll, i can get the access if possible i can i can help you some of you maybe uh, before the deadline we have we have another 15 days right i'll try to get if you if i can uh, help you out i'll ask you to submit the word file uh, the application which you wanted to submit and i'll send you the uh, plagiarism uh, report how much percentage uh, less than five percentage it is normal or even less than seven ten percent sometimes so i can help you with that and uh, for now don't come to me and ask the check the plagiarism i don't recommend because you have much time i will at least recommend before five days not now so keep revising even if you have finished the document still i will recommend keep remi uh, uh, keep revising and then we'll submit later and uh, this sheet must be created within this one and past present field of study here may be true uh, past present field of study uh, but this is field of study so here you can put you need not to you need not to say that your yeah, bachelor's masters have this experience i think this you can put but in the experience column they cannot put a uh, research plan yeah you can put whatever you have done so far the uh, projects are the research and the research theme plan in the japan describe articulatory yeah this one i have been talking in many places so please watch the videos i will recommend highly and it will be helpful for you research plan yeah research plan also research plan i have find uh, good observations uh, those who are not completed their graduation degree how can we put thesis mahak sharma san that's the comment i am suggesting i am not saying it's final and i don't want to take any pride out of it uh, this is my understanding and uh, my seniors and the juniors we do so we do the current state the thesis title will be there not just for mixed scholarship even the internal university processing sometimes we need this thesis title we submit even the placement time we don't have final thesis title we just submit as on date you may think this is the thesis title out after your course so that title i am recommending just put that one and submit this document because all your explanation will go similar to that title and that title need not to, need not to be the final title which you will be submitting so that is my comment about the thesis need not to be completed for the submission so research plan uh, like the timeline is important put your timeline properly realistically and objectives people are writing uh, below uh, research theme i think here you can put research theme on objectives i think i have explained in our research plan uh, document discussion put objectives i think for phd i will recommend put three major major objectives at least three where is my video yeah sorry three major objectives and for master student i would recommend put two major objectives supporting you can put two or at least two i don't, I don't recommend so many it looks like uh, not practical uh, uh, at least for the uh, guidance in iit in india that is you know the standards are very high for us they recommend this much so we don't uh, even the, my seniors guide us the similar way 
put uh, three to four i think i commented uh, reviewed the documents and even i told them one of the aspirant in the nimble prerina email id i have sent back so the objectives you put two or three masters phd based on that and additionally you can put one or two more it's okay for minor minor objectives and then in this document further uh, the timeline timeline uh, uh, documentation experimental work simulation development i have discussed in the research plan document uh, video in the you can see the playlist or even the popular videos that is in the second most visited video you will find in the playlist in the home page of this channel so that also i will highly recommend uh, to watch again i have discussed it dedicatedly i think the explanation may be uh, better so that thing timeline and uh, objectives and uh, what you will do uh, in the in the paragraph after this uh, the details go to the point exactly what you have done what you can do why why you want to do these things try to answer in an i in a pictorial or in a paragraph are in a bold and bullets points so this is a recommendation uh this is call from this person uh, this cop okay so a trend uh please join the live i am talking join the live i can talk to in june check link group i'm texting in the whatsapp group he's asking to Mm, sorry actually this is in the i think there it is in the video description i am saying the link is there june it is he is calling me in a personal call sorry actually there are some spammers i don't want to point out them but be careful i in the group i am not talking about them because it's i don't want to blame each other but it is there that's why i am saying but there is reason why i am saying uh, some certain spam comments send us password and username oh god this guy is crazy please watch live see the comments or description for link i'm posting the comment for uh, the zoom uh, in the chat box also you can see for those who wanted to join but for now let me complete this one after that i'll talk to you i think uh, that's all a research plan i told two three points major points research plan yeah there is no uh, standard format because uh, every time people do different way even when i get the comments i see in different different formats i don't recommend i i don't say i did not say it is wrong or right but i said which is not good so in the format i said the corrections so the, i didn't say everything same format for different people there are different formats they representing that is okay and uh, first two years in one university and next two years in another university completed at 2021 uh, i have completed my bachelor two different university getting transfer and migration certificate is this affect my selection i think no uh, <coughs> sorry i think it won't affect uh, shakti san the final uh, whatever you are graduating that you share it if they ask you can produce in the uh, documents later on for now no it is okay hello sir ask, sorry for asking about another scholarship in this video would you mind telling two to three tips for interview examination for abp scholarship ah uh, there is no issue if you ask this related scholarships we have discussed so no problem so interview tips actually uh, <clears throat> abp scholarship uh, i think we have interviewed one of the students from chennai she has mentioned i think feedback you can watch the video additionally uh, whatever we are talking whatever we are talking here about the context or the videos which will be similar for other scholarship we are trying to help you the way to answer not the answers so better you can follow this uh, follow these guidance and try to use uh, uh, the point to point like uh, what do you call share link here oh my god this person <laughs> the group uc group i think uh, those who are watching in uc group there are a lot of discussions but uh, for, sadly for them there are less slots com uh, even the uh, opportunities compared to pg and uh, that's a normal competition let me share for him i think he's uh, where is the link can somebody share him if they are watching here the link in the whatsapp group or shall i share it let me see 
ABP interview. It is there, right? ABP interview. Uh, it is shared in the live uh, in the previous videos. No, where is the live? Uh, uh, please share him the link. Uh, if somebody can share it, I couldn't copy it. Let me share this screenshot to him. I shared the video link, right? Why he's asking the, uh, this one? Ibrahim, thank you for sharing. Uh, yeah, please join this link. Uh, uh, please check this link description. This is funny. <laughs> anyway, these people actually, I'm not saying negative, but uh, their interest levels goes down and the competition is already high. So they get eliminated. So I'm not saying about him, but I have seen similar situations. Okay. Uh, about this placement from the last one, uh, it is actually for now you can ignore. I just uh, recommend you just put some names on the schools as per your interest. Don't worry about approval and all these things on this date for PG at least. So, <laughs> yeah, I think I can take questions now or even I can answer uh, uh, on the go uh, in the chat box. Okay, this one and the next one I wanted to discuss about. Uh, is the Brazil uh, Brazil 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 uh, Brazil student experience in uh, Sukuba University that one uh, before that I'll discuss about scholarship then I will discuss at the end University University of Sukuba she also had some similar experience and comments from the <coughs> discussion Brazil mixed student hey, guys you trust me or not she also has such a bad experience she got uh, she applied and she applied she couldn't get for masters <laughs> and then she got now let me tell you that story brazil student <coughs> uh, experience phd okay this i'll share meanwhile i'll uh, try to i will try to answer the comment box questions chat box questions wait Okay, this is this much week. Okay, this is fine. And no, where is my screen? <laughs> ah, these days are getting clock and clock and these people. Uh, I don't want to su miss supporting you, so I'm trying my time. Okay, let me. Where is this one? Okay, I'm putting my screen bigger. So where is the chat box? So chat box I'll put beside me. You will see on the screen from now. Where is that? Chat box participants support. I'm trying to get some this one and the chat box chat window. Studio. Yes. Yes, it is on the screen now. So I put my where is this side I it a little bit transform to the right okay yeah so questions you can see on the screen actually this will be not readable so I'll make this uh, share blank yes let's answer these questions few more on the chat box so uh, sorry for this question i think abp scholarship please check the video interview and uh, questions i can even guide you once you clear certain rounds and the interview guidance i can one i can talk to you i can give you some tips that don't worry for now i think you can, initially you don't need any uh, individual guidance you can do it from the videos whatever we are discussing and uh, thank you anandra sir he is from chennai he is supporting everywhere thank you he is not a student he is a company person Sir, any idea how many people got selected last year uh, in India? I think we discussed it, Rasan, in the previous time. Uh, it was very short. I don't remember exact number. We shared in one of the video uh, immediately after the, I think before the second round selection last time. So it is very few numbers. Uh, single digit, uh, sorry, double digit, 10 to 20 maybe. So, uh, but don't worry about slots because sometimes the results are very interesting. Some people got even even though they have very moderate profiles still they got succeeded 
and they got the fellowship so don't worry about this uh, slots you keep your efforts there are different stories uh tanga selvan son same here looking for abp interview good uh, you can uh, discuss together i think chennai people there are already a couple of people got it uh, you may i mean indian indian students you can explore sir there are 15 slot for undergrad in next for india only or globally actually uh, there is no fixed slots even that number changes so you <coughs> that numbers will be 10 to 15 or even 20 sometimes so to, link is shared uh, thank you link is already shared thank you uh let me have your contact let us discuss if you are interested you can share the contacts in the whatsapp group uh, each other it's up to your risk i mean i'm not connected with uh, individual problems so you can discuss it's up to you i have watched the video you made with her i am happy that it was huge help for full filling the documents and also i want to know more about interview examination would you mind tell me the contact details or something further questions interview thank you sir please excuse me for sharing other people contacts because they are the many people had the same problems when we give the contacts they are asking all the basic questions and they are in busy schedule but i can help you discussing because we are in touch with the person so we can discuss and get back to you that i can do so please uh, keep the questions posted uh, if there is something i cannot answer i can discuss and get back to you so don't worry in that way but contacts i think they are not willing to share i'm sorry with that uh, also as master's applicant does my research plan and theme has to be very thorough and extensive since uh, i have no research experience as undergrad also master's applicant does my research plan and theme has to be very thorough thorough and extensive uh, actually uh, this is my recommendation uh, there is no hard and fast rule for the students but i would recommend because as a fo followers of the community of our nimble prerena i want you to get succeed so i would recommend to revise and revise and there is no connection with the research plan and the selection and the, there is no connection with the uh, i mean direct connection there is no direct connection with the cgp and the selection also and the research plan and selection also it is all like uh, collective decisions we don't know there are di different parameters some of the things i have broken i broke down in the public recently i mean to say i shared in the public uh, that may be the reasons the sdgs and the uh, country growth those are ki a kind of background themes they may follow as a as a bilateral uh, uh, connections so i would recommend that is few suggestions you can focus those things and improve your uh, document that will be good no need and it need not to be your uh, having research experience but if you read uh, it's recommended to read some papers journal papers because that's what you are going to do if you get selected for the scholarship writing some journals so reading the journal documents and submitting a similar way the style or writing in a, a quality in the quantity qualitative way sorry qualitative way is a good thing so read some journals and then write it and revise it mm, yeah i could say uh, uh, nowhere in public even many forums you don't find anything authentic they will say uh, like me and there may be some more people who are analyzing very clearly they are commenting so that may be helpful but it's not 100 percent as it is but the success rate may be improved and uh, I think that I answered this one. Uh, I'm happy that you are also IBP scholarship. Yes, of course, we can discuss. Good luck uh, uh, for both of you. Which will be better if I get a recommendation letter from my CS teacher now or after the application form or out? Actually, a recommendation letter form may be for all of you who are uh, listening and who are watching this video later. I would recommend please get it as soon as possible. There is no connection with this selection. You can keep it in hand because sometimes when you really want it the person may be busy or you may uh, you may not able to get the get the what do you call get the recommendation letter in the way you want it or maybe he can give you better one so i would recommend get it before this is what my professors do uh, when we were in iit even here also so that is the recommendation because uh, it is good to have it earlier uh, yeah for undergrad also you can try to get before there is no i think it should be okay one month difference are right it don't should be okay sir does our paper goes to japan or india for passing first screening you are saying son this is an interesting question and uh, 
<laughs> sorry to say i heard recently they are sending for plagiarism and proper review to the faculty in japan and then they're get ba- getting back getting back to you the results to the embassy and the, to you so i don't know before but recently i heard it is happening so it is going maybe the de- uh, they won't know in the research plan there is no personal details they won't know about you they will only know what you are writing so they will judge on the document that's why i'm saying write your document as concise as straightforward point to point i mean technically your uh, subject knowledge so then you may have some better opportunity or better uh, chances of selection and uh, another query is being fluent in reading and writing japanese and appearing for japanese language paper as masters applicant compulsory what is compulsory it is in the previous uh, somebody is commenting uh, can you review my undergrad form on second uh, yeah i think uh, I'll, uh, if you have fluency in japanese and writing and reading even that is a good way i uh, i would recommend also if you can do that one please go for japanese based masters program you don't worry about english programs the competition levels may be different i mean you may have advantage but getting that level is difficult so you are if you are having it you are welcome go ahead and try to try to what do you call uh, try to give the uh, application in japanese version and say that you want to study in japanese program they will don't worry they will give you the language course for 6 months there you will have intense course so that you can uh, uh, you can even improve further to understand the subjects in the japanese that will even help your career prospects in japan because we already know some english you are knowing japanese it will definitely improve your career prospects also and already there is a chance to you can get into japan with this uh, uh, fellowship so i think if you can do that it's good thing uh, it's not it's not completely bad for others it's not i'm not saying that but for them it will be some advantage will be there we cannot do it easily so that efforts matters and uh, can you review my undergrad form uh, uh, no problem please share it uh, to the nimble prerna at gmail.com i can do that uh, uh, but it may take some time uh, but i'll definitely do nimble prerna at gmail.com you can send to this one and i am blu pre or yeah. nimble prerna means actually it's a fast motivation uh, it's like quick and uh, clear motivation that's why i put the name uh, and prerna is a motivation from india nimble is a western word so i just like the theme so i put uh, there is nothing secret so uh if i apply for english program i don't have to appear for japanese language paper uh actually you still have to apply japanese language paper but uh, uh you, know, you may uh, you may be excluded from the uh, japanese consideration i mean they don't worry about how you write but as a embassy applicant person you don't have option to skip japanese or the culture studies i have read the guidelines recently when i shared you the review you have no option you have to you have to study language and culture even after coming here so you have to write the exam maybe they may not consider for selection i could say but you have to write for embassy route especially there is no option we have to study something about culture we have to improve our understandings will the acceptance letter of the any university will work only those which are government universities and fall under max program i think this i have discussed very nicely in the recent uh, lives i think uh, one of the video i shared about i think live 4 or live 3 i'm not sure i think the yeah the uh, ultimate secret nobody told before that video uh, live number playlist uh, weekly lives where is a weekly live in the playlist so where is the playlist past live streams in the live streams yeah the live number 6 uh, try to watch live number 6 mr opposite face this i name i'll share this live numbers each live is i am actually putting some good contents try to utilize you will be really happy at the selection this is live 6 even if you don't get selected you will have good knowledge or understanding that you can use in other countries or even other under- applications also i'm putting like that sorry live 6 actually live 6 in the chat okay so you can uh, watch this video live 6 and uh, universities actually uh, you watch this one because they have uh, the uh, next means their education it's a education ministry they are supporting particular uh, uh, developments of the country 
through the scholarships or the through the funding it's a government funding so uh, maybe a sele- universities may be there and even uh, i think i'll start the i think here from here i'll start about that uh, the brazil university student experience in that sukuba university that connects to this answer also wait a minute uh, jee mains is now postponed 20 to 29 june is there any chance for next dates to coincide with the jee main dates if it then what will do i do uh i'd say embassy decides these dates maybe they may consider in a positive op- optimistic side but be prepared for both sides i mean if there is a conflict uh, what to choose you to be prepared but i won't recommend uh, thinking too much and getting anxious uh, i would recommend what is in our hand let's do that i would recommend that so for now i think you choose both side and then uh, decide accordingly and uh, let's see what happens that is true it may overlap uh, sometimes but mostly they may consider it uh, that was if people for uh, mixed so uh, yeah the brazil student story the brazil uh, scholar she is a phd scholar in sukuba university so she has a good un- understanding uh, what do you call uh, where is this one are what is this man <laughs> lovely shakti here please uh, don't ask in the group public uh, they are uh, come in response in uh, to you in public it's you are lucky but i won't see that is happening so just ignore it you can if there is a reply you personally talk to them personally and this guidance some students from pakistan is asking uh, i don't know what is the question he is asking someone to guide if he is in live please uh, ask the question here mr vacuar i don't know <laughs> okay please comment or call the video shared link already actually that's the difference in uh, culture of growth so the queries are understanding levels are different so i now i because i have been working with other international scholars so now i don't feel any difficulty it is normal people from different places have different comments or experiences or way of interactions are different so it is normal so where is this one yeah she has tried for this brazilian student she has tried for mixed embassy for masters once twice oh she is he is again asking share the link she you already shared in the group no what is this person man <laughs> sorry i'm not player scroll saying anything wrong let me forward to him yes that's a difference in uh, the, the way they work it's okay that's nothing wrong so uh, the brazilian student uh, she has tried for masters twice or twice for my embassy i think or even for university she couldn't get into the scheme she is from i think life sciences school school of life sciences i think we got a good link i should share the screen now uh, uh where is the link let me get back the link then i'll share so she got uh, this school uh, in uh, uh, life sciences in university of sukuba after two three trials she didn't given up uh, she didn't given up and then she said like what do you recommend for aspi- aspiring students she is recommending not to give up that's what she recommended for all of you from her it's her words even i am recommend same thing don't give up you will get succeed even one now or later that is one thing and the second thing uh, about the trial spot uh where is this link so the university has uh, this is another interesting update some student is asking no uh, the universities which university yeah in the comment box which universities fall under mixed so she said that even in the university of sukuba there are not many faculty even other schools she whom she contacted they don't have the mixed scholarship slots for the school or for the university so it may happen for others also so i would recommend uh keep trying keep exploring uh, contacting professor seems to be the best option but uh, getting their response you heard in the recent interview with another s- scholar from the hoko university it may not be uh, always true that they will respond to you in a short time so that is uh, i'll recommend uh, you can keep trying i'm trying to get the link uh, she said i have asked her uh, the university of sukuba uh, schools link there was a list of schools you can approach so that is one thing another one is that uh, the scheme the university scheme uh, she got into one school and then the the program what she joined that is also something interesting 
the new latest technologies or the advanced schools or the advanced centers they like considering foreign uh, for, sorry foreign graduates or foreign talents they invite and the next fund them so that's how she also got into some uh, school where that is innovation of uh, some i don't want to specify she didn't care <laughs> she's not happy to share that is one side another side i asked about living expenses and the survival in university of sukuba i, I think it's in ibaraki ibaraki i'm not sure you can check university of sukuba that location actually in hokkaido university here i'm in hokkaido university here uh the dormitories are cheaper but you cannot live more than six months one semester is a maximum you can live but uh university of sukuba the story was interesting she said like uh it's not a big city there is a lot of nature and lot of foreigners but not a party city about expenses i live in a dormitory uh of the university it is really a small room just to sleep and toilet it is a small room japanese style normal shower kitchen is shared with other students so i pay like only sixteen thousand yen and the fun part or the interesting part from to me in Hokkaido University, that option is not there. In the University of Tsukuba, they can stay for entire course for two years or three years. That's interesting. You can live at moderate lifestyle. You can save money. Even those who are coming for self-funded, you can survive. And uh, in Hokkaido University, you cannot live for full sale, full course. Only for beginning, you can get 16,000 for N plus utilities and all. It will go some 20 to 30,000 N Japanese yen. She mentioned. And she's going to private apartment because if you are in the university or dormitory, we cannot get our friends inside. It is restricted. So it is a trade-off. <laughs> if you want to have freedom and all, it is uh, lowest rent is 25,000 yen. Uh, she's mentioning she's going to private apartment sooner. But this is a uh, option is there for those who are serious, who cannot afford and all. Uh, yeah, science and innovation school. Uh, there is a link. Uh, where did I put? I actually bookmarked for sharing with you. I'm trying to check. Uh, yeah. So she tried a process of three three times. She tried. I told three times. Under graduation and submitted all the things and uh, not not selected for interview. And uh, started my masters and CV. Uh, they, uh, I mean, she started working in uh, with improving CV with masters at Brazil itself. Then she came here for PhD after these trials, and. Uh, under embassy track uh, she is also recommending university track because they can, you have option uh, you have option to what do you call to speak to the professor or the research directly so that that one uh, where is the link 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 i want to share this, this link i got so this link i'll share the screen that is my screen share Chrome share yes no yes this one I will reduce my reducing the screen okay let's uh, put it down so you can see the screen ah oh, it's still visible the word file right I'll change to Chrome yes University of Tsukuba, the comment section, I'll just answer. There are some comments. I'll just answer. Just let me finish this short one. And we have 10 minutes. This one hour I thought live. I'll complete the live sooner. And before that, I'll answer your questions. Where is this one? Yes. Uh, this chat box I want to hide. Chat, 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 chat. Finish. Okay. So, these schools, you can find there are a lot of schools. I'll share this link in the chat box. We can explore. Ah, I shared the YouTube link again. Let's use this link. That is six link. I'll share this Sukuba link. Yeah, this is a chart. I have shared the link. The next one, University of Sukuba. You can choose the uh, programs by using this link. There are many centers. Many uh, maybe those who are uh, having less hope for your profile, you better. Uh, Santil Kumar WhatsApp group link, uh, please find in the description. I think it is there. Uh, a PG group WhatsApp group link in this uh, description of the video. You'll find WhatsApp group link. Um, next WhatsApp group. I think the link link is still active. Please check and let me know. Even Telegram link and below that WhatsApp group link is there in the description. 
So this we uh, this uh, page I am recommending to check for there are all, many options, many schools. Even there are asking about medicine and other other disciplines, right? You can explore by using this link, and then check for the fellowship opportunities within the school. I think she is falls some uh, somewhere in the life science school. I found so they may not have all the schools may not have mixed mext slots for foreigners. But here you see masters, doctoral, masters, doctor, MD, MD, MD. So I will recommend please explore this link very well. It will be useful. And I think this link is a good thing. I will put it in the description also. You can put description. Uh, yeah, University of Tsukuba programs. Next, I put in the description also for those who are missing the link here. If that is not working, you can ping me up. I'll share it maybe in the Facebook group or our Facebook group, Nimble Perena Facebook group. Where is this one? The community tab or even the videos. Anyway, uh, I'll see later. You can I'll post it again. That is my screen. And I'll answer the Q&A now, from now. And then I think that's a short story, living expenses about uh, Sukuba University and uh, the uh, way you can try. And uh, her feedback was good, less people, and it's not a party city, uh, something, a couple of things. Yeah, that's what I could say. Uh, where is this one? And thank you for these 1,000 subscribers. Actually, we started more long back one year ago due to our COVID and all we delayed, but now it reached 1K milestone. Thank you very much, all of you. Where is this one? Uh, screen share, I'll stop. And chat box, I'll put up. Yeah, let me answer the Q&A now. I think this Pakistani friend, whether he is commented here, I'm not sure. I told him he's asking. Mm, one second. Put a bit bigger. You can see my gestures if I comment. Okay, actually the thunder I like. Be like a thunder. <laughs> That's why I put the background. So where is this one? Q and A. I answered up to uh, anim clips. This question I answered. When I complete my medicine or nursing in Japan, they'll allow me to operate patients. I think this I have discussed last week uh, when I reviewed the application document. Many people are not watching the video till the end or even in between I give some good updates you are missing. So try to watch at least you spend time. We are not, uh, at least I am not sharing something which is for channel purpose because full intensive contents are there in channel that I heard very, very rare one or two channels may have such things. So try to watch you will be finding useful for this answer medicine or nursing actually no i think that is the, there in the guidelines review video recent guidelines review application review video so you cannot uh, you cannot uh, go for operating patients you need to get the license and japanese legal approval something is there you need to get that certification then only you are allowed that is clearly mentioned in the notification and can I apply for mixed UG both from embassy recommendation and university recommendation route? I am happy for your excitement and uh, interest, but I am sorry for uh, university recommendation. UG I hardly seen anywhere. One or two places I heard, but I didn't get the proper uh, information. But it is for PG, they can apply for both. For UG, I think uh, you cannot. Uh, I think there was one student who is waiting for second round selection. Maybe if he comes to Okada University, I'll interview him and share the feedback with you. He is saying that it's a university recommended, but it's actually private funded. I think uh, the university specific funded. I think not for all the universities have the UG mixed, PZ mixed also not there for all. So how it is a bit competitive. And then uh, what is the other one? I don't have GRA alerts. It will be decrease my chances. No, I just said. I just explained clearly it is good to have doesn't mean that it is i mean you may directly say that if it's good means it's bad not like that so it is all uh diplomatic comments no this uh the, the diplomatic relation applications right it is, they may consider it in a better way but uh, it's all they need to filter out at the, at the end of the day they have to filter out the applications I have, uh, you can apply, I would say, eyelids, eyelids, GRE, don't worry, you can apply, there is no comment, there, I have seen both people, I mean, who are having these things and selected, who doesn't have anything, they still got selected, I have seen, I have talked to them, 
uh, both sides uh, i have n4 jlbt certificate and 8.5 bands in eyelids so what do you think is my application stronger or enough for uz for uz uh, you may be uh, better but i still say it is competition so even uh, it's uh, it's again uh, the time you're applying the program you're applying ct or stc or uh, uz program and the application they are receiving it's all factored so knowingly i cannot say simply it is easy or tough maybe you have better chances you can try out and let me know feedback in our group maybe we can share for the others can you give me active whatsapp group link sir is it not active that is active group only in the description the whatsapp group uh, two uh, a pg group in mixed scholarship can we study mbbs i don't see mbbs directly maybe the names they call i'm not sure they say the medical schools and uh, written, uh, other names uh, medical sciences so please explore i'm not sure about that when can i see the list of colleges for mixed for university recommendation we, uh, university recommendation they, nobody compiled it because every time the slots and the university gets added up and nobody is doing regularly because each person interests are different they are not having time even i have shared some link in the somewhere i shared i think in our facebook group maybe our facebook page an email for enough page i shared somewhere you can find all the universities filters but it doesn't say that mixed or not it is giving that national university or not like that sukuba list of university there is there sukuba list of universities is there that i have shared this link you can filter out uh actually this is uh, i don't think you will find next to the list if you find please share it i never come across so far uh okay where can i see the list of colleges that has talked thank you for sir hard work i will contact you in email about interview examination keep your great work thank you mr santil kumar san you're welcome and uh just four minutes to go if you have any other comments please let me know and if any of you wanted to join our uh, group i mean if you have time if you get selected or something if you want to work uh i think uh this new th thumbnails and uh, uh the editing i'm going to make some more uh, information videos on locations so that requires some more people to be together it will be good if you are interested put me in uh nimble prerina email id maybe i'll get back to you if you can if you, if you find suitable and if you we should not overburden you the subtitles correction also we have automated subtitles we need to correct them so if somebody can do i'll be happy if you can join the hands so there is nothing specific specific or personal at this moment uh, i cannot uh, pay anything but if the things go well uh, maybe if we get more support in the future we may can pay also for that but not now but that is another place people do uh, work as a part time i have seen some people are uh, working somewhere and working for other uh, video developing or media groups so that's a comment or suggestions so i will stop this live today so thank you for joining 12th results are and done so it we do put predicted transcripts right not predicted transcript whatever is in hand the till last year that's it you cannot put predicted it is not allowed don't do that let me see this pakistani friend what he is saying this question he's asking are you studying in japan <laughs> anyone you see my videos you will understand right i am keeping all details public uh, okay his question is that there is application document it says that tertiary undergraduate secondary senior secondary junior high school and elementary school he is asking how to fill this document so this is same for uz application so i would recommend uh, if fill from the bottom uh, the latest education go down until where you can get the details last column if you don't have on if you don't have elementary school details or certification ignore it but you can put you can put from which date to which date and years you can put that one should be okay in undergrad which 